as you said that uh, it's a old cultivation method in israel and most of the banana is covered under the net houses only now so can you tell me what kind of net it is used for this kind of practice okay the general pra practice is uh, is a uh, net that gives us uh, 10% uh, shade uh, we call it a crystal net okay it's uh, transparent and uh, it's very strong so this is one of the reason we use it uh, in this uh, in this field we experiment uh, other uh, type of uh, of uh, net uh, uh, namely the pearl net uh, of 20% uh, shade and 30% shade. So do you get any extra benefit or what is the result so far? Uh, there is, it, it, this experiment only goes on for uh, two years because the, the plantation is only two years old. Uh, but uh, we already can see some benefits in the 30% uh, shade of uh, the pearl uh, net. It gives us a little bit more uh, more uh, weight, uh, bunch weight, mm -hmm. and uh, it seems that the um, in general uh, the plantation is stronger. Uh, so um, this is uh, first results, and we'll have to confirm them during the next uh, uh, three or four years. Uh, this experiment will last for six years probably. Uh, we also measure here the the level of uh, transpiration mm -hmm. and uh, a level of uh, of sun radiation. Uh, so uh, with all those, uh, we hope to have uh, some uh, uh, specific results uh, in the next few years. So Gal, you were talking about some uh, yes. mat and the spacing between the mats. So can you explain this a little bit more? The spacing between the rows is four and a half meters. Okay. And between one mat to the next one, it's uh, three and a half meters. And we plant initially three plants per mat. Okay. So overall, we have um, about uh, 63 mats per uh, dunam or 600 uh, per per hectare and because you have to triple it because we have three per mat so it's about uh, 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 1800 uh, uh, plants per hectare which variety you are using it's a uh, grand name is the main variety we also have uh, other varieties that are local varieties so Gal, as I said, we are cutting the flowers in this cultivation practice. Why are you cutting those flowers? Uh, we want to uh, reserve the, the uh, resources of the of the plant. Uh, we don't want it to uh, to uh, produce something that we don't use, and uh, all the those uh, male bud uh, we don't we of course don't don't use them. Uh, only. Only the female flowers becoming bananas. The other flower are just uh, are just uh, going to waste. So in order to stop the growing of the unwanted uh, organ, we just cut it. As you can see, banana has a trellising system, and you can see this trellising system is uh, supporting the banana plants. We'll go to have a closer look. Gal, can you tell me a little bit about the support system in banana? How do we support the plants? Okay, supporting system is incorporated within the the structure, the, the whole structure of the net house. Okay, yes. so the structure has cable that uh, carries the net uh, about uh, six meters uh, high. And then we have a supporting cable, which is in about... Uh, 4.2 meters and uh, its purpose is to prop uh, the the, uh, the plants uh, so they don't uh, topple uh, 
when when the bunch uh, begins to uh, fill it, fill up. So what is the average size of the bunch? One bunch is how many kilograms? One bunch uh, between uh, 30 to uh, 40, sometimes 50 kilos. Uh, do you have a special kind of uh, wire that you use to support the plant? Any denier or any strength parameter for this wire? What kind of uh, twine that you select to uh, the, the support? Twine, the, the rope, the, the twine is uh, uh, a twine that, uh, that can support uh, about 300 kilos. Oh. Connect with us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube or log on to www.agriplast.co.in.